and before i didn't used to get time reality is that ma'am but now I, that's why i thought why shouldn't i start my journey again actually when i was in my college that time i learned many things and i used to speak with my friends so already you are engaging her in drawing and some craft work and she is going for she can sit let me see that one thing it's too naughty and this is such a mischievous hello i am from kolkata i am a homemaker and i have a daughter uh, if i talk about my qualification i have done my graduation um, or master degree in accounts bcom stream this is okay. all about myself ma'am this is all about me okay so you are learning to be fluent isn't it yeah ma'am yeah, yes yeah. what is the reason why do you want to become fluent in english do you have some aspiration some goals no ma'am actually when i was in my college that time i learned many things and i used to speak with my friends <laughs> But after marriage, I didn't get the environment, and I forgot many things. So nowadays, I am observing that many women are aware of this language, and we can create this language around us. That's why I thought, why shouldn't I start my journey again? <laughs> so you started your journey again, and when did you start your journey again? Earlier. Yeah, when- I- I just started. two days ago. I just create account on this app. Just two days ago. Oh yes. my god! I created, I created my account on this app. Thank I you. thought that now it's the right time because now there is awareness. Everyone wants to be fluent in English. So why shouldn't I start my journey again? That's really great. That's really great that you thought of uh, doing something. Actually, it's not only about spoken English or uh, learning English or learning. Yeah, English. Then I get bored while sitting at home because now my daughter has become seven years old, and before I didn't used to get time. Reality is that, ma'am. But now yes. I I get some time for me. I make some time. That's yes, why I thought I should connect with local and. A, that's why i'm starting started my journey again ma'am this is the main reason that's great that's great that you started and now i think just two days back you uh, uploaded as you said that this uh, not uploaded sorry downloaded yes you yeah. downloaded this app and you have started so you are speaking well and i think you will get even better fluency once you practice on a regular basis what yeah ma'am i will definitely practice on regular basis now i'm not going to leave this language again <laughs> sure that's so great so when i left that language that time i used to stuck while speaking i so i thought that why i left that language i can i used to speak then why should i why didn't i left i should continue this language that's why i thought now i have to do this anyhow so you thought that once i was speaking so why should i leave this journey why should i not continue this journey and that's the reason you started this journey wonderful so okay you let me know that so far how many people have you connected with ma'am um, i have connected with only two people okay <laughs> because ma'am yeah. i I didn't get only that much time because nowadays the summer vacation has started, so my daughter is at home, so I have to do lots of work. That's yes, fun. that's true. That summer vacation is going on. In which class uh, does your child study? That she your... studies in class C. 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 You said that you belong to Kolkata, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, yeah, my mom belong to Kolkata. Okay, okay. So you just have one daughter. Yeah, ma'am. I have one daughter. She's a sing- single child. <laughs> okay, and that one daughter consumes all your time because she has summer vacation. What all things yeah. she is doing these days? Your daughter is doing these days. Ma'am, nowadays I I just engage her in drawing, painting because yes. she doesn't have anything to do now. That's why. Oh, it's very hot. A uh, hot outside scorching. I can't take her outside too. Yeah, it's very hot in India. It's that better I... that I should engage her in some activity work. Now she is doing this kind of activity, ma'am. 
Okay, that's lovely. Is she a good dancer or singer? Because mostly, yeah, she is good. Name, ma'am. She is good dancer. She goes to dance class, and she goes to drawing class too. Okay, but these days yeah, during, during summer vacation, is she going? No, yes, ma'am. She okay. she goes. And that's fantastic. During the summer vacation too. So already you are engaging her in drawing and some craft work, and she is going for. Ma'am, she can't sit. Let me sit at one place. She is too naughty, and she is she is such a mischievous. I can't She's... tell you. <laughs> she is very mischievous. Okay, so she is a small child. If she will not be mischievous at this age, then well, yes. Think of our childhood. How much much naughty and mischievous we were! I especially yeah. my age. Yeah, you are quite younger than me. But uh, yes, children are meant to do do these things. Actually, what will they do? Sometimes I get tired of. Sometimes I get tired of her mischievous activity. I can't handle all that time. <laughs> oh my God! Such a small baby you have, and you get tired of. So how do you handle her? Um, I told you now. I always try to engage her in some activities. Uh, so, uh, then she remains quiet and she remains busy in doing those activities. Uh, yeah, ma'am. She always sits at one and when she always sits at one place and she engages in her activity. She remains engaged in doing her activities. Uh, yes, uh, that's great. Nowadays, I'm started watching some conversation videos. Okay. That I was watching few uh, hours ago Priyanka's ma'am video. That time I saw you in her video and got surprised that I got a chance to <laughs> connect with you. Yes. Because I want to improve my speaking English as soon as possible. You will. That's you fine. Well, anything if you desire and if you try working towards it. You will certainly achieve it. It's a, just a language, nothing very special, isn't it? So, what all the things you are finding? Well, it's it's just a not a tough. Everyone says, says everyone says that English is a tough language. I don't think so. It's just yeah. like Hindi, but you just need to express yourself. Yes, it's just a language actually. No matter it is Hindi or English. For me, if you ask me, Bengali is equally difficult. Yeah, because I because I but don't I know. Ma'am, I live in Kolkata, but I don't speak Bengali too. Bengali, it's a difficult to <laughs> be. That's what that's understand what. Bengali, but I don't speak. Yeah, that, that's what I was saying. That not only English, any language. If we don't know, then it is difficult. And if we know, it's easy. It's simple. It's easy. Yes, even Ma many know something about you. I don't know anything. Anything you don't know, so know about me. I have, I think, I have shared my channel with you. Did I share my channel with you? I didn't share. Okay, so I'll share the link to my channel. You can go, you can visit there. But certainly, I'll tell you some a little about me. I am Manju Mishra. I'm from Lucknow, and I have been a teacher since 1990. So you can say by profession, I'm a teacher, but now I'm retired. Okay, and I got retired in the year nine uh, 2022. Oh my and God! I'm so that, glad that I'm talking to a teacher, <laughs> and that to a retired teacher. <laughs> oh my God! You have a lot of experience, ma'am. You are experienced older. Yeah. Yes, you can say because uh, more than thirty-two, thirty-three years I taught in a proper school campus. It's a long and, time, long time. Yes, and it's after that, time. and after that also I didn't leave this profession. Actually, I'm not teaching in any of the campus, any of the institute, but I'm still connected to different learners. I'm taking paid classes. I too take free sessions as I'm taking session with you. So that's how still I make myself busy. I'm blessed with two children. I have a son. I have a daughter. Both are working in that field, so there are no more small kids. I'm totally I'm free. I love you. You don't have any responsibility. <laughs> you can enjoy it. <laughs> yes, and I am enjoying. I am enjoying actually. I'm um, connecting with the different people, learning from them, and something if I have, I teach them. I just share my knowledge and experience with all my learners. So this is what all I, I'm doing these days. 
and I'm enjoying. That is in I short. I feel very happy when I connect to new strangers that I get to know everything about themselves. It makes me very happy. I don't know I why. Look, oh, you look quite uh, no jolly person. I can see that you are uh, very yeah, happy. I can I can mingle with anyone. I'm such a, a people. Can, I don't I don't hesitate to talk to anyone. I'm such a I can I, speak with anyone. This is the basic trait to learn anything. If you start expressing yourself and getting to know others, that's how uh, language comes. Yeah. Any language, if you want to learn, you start speaking in that language and you start listening to that language and you will learn very soon. It will not take much time. Okay, Mama, nowadays, are you leaving Sweden? Uh, yes, yes. Nowadays, I have come to my daughter's place. So, yes, I am in Sweden. And that's Sweden, the reason. Mama, it's very good because it's very hot in India. And here it's quite pleasant. Yeah, the hot is unbearable. Uh, I, I know, I know it here somewhere around 45, 46, 48, 49. Uh, still temperature is yeah. going. So yes, it, it is quite hot in India. But here in Sweden, it's quite pleasant. The temperature is oh, somewhere, uh, somewhere around 18 uh, to 20. So it's quite yeah, pleasant. It's, 40 it's very hot. Yes. I can't. <laughs> yes, so it is very hot in India. So you are right that it's unbearable actually. But I never had that in mind. I have to live in India. So we are used to of uh, bearing this kind of temperature. But still, we too feel like going to Nanita. I think that this year it's unbearable hot. I okay. haven't faced this kind of hot here in Kolkata. But this time it's unbearable. I can't see. Every year it's becoming more and more. And mm -hmm. I think, I think to some extent, we are responsible for it. Yeah, ma'am, we are responsible because nowadays everyone has an AC in their house. They, they, no one wants to live without AC. No one wants to live without AC. And more than that, outside, if you go, you don't have trees. People are cutting trees, making houses, making factories, making buildings. You can see everywhere around us, only building, building, building. You can't find even a single tree. Yes, that's true. And uh, uh, very uh, especially this apartment system. In just one apartment, nearly 200, 500 flats are there. So at a certain place, so many people are living. Every house has one or two air conditions. So um, these are... Yes, Ma'am, may I ask, do you find trees in there? Pardon? Ma'am, do you find trees there? So much of trees, so much of greenery, I can say, full of nature, full wow. of less of population, hardly anybody you will find on the road. If you go to mall, maybe you will find that, yes, some people live in this country too. If you are walking on the road, maybe in ha half a kilometer, you will find one or two uh, people just on the road. They are doing their work. So population is very less and it's full of nature. Wow. I feel really either water or just rocks or trees. So, it sounds good, ma'am. But here, whenever you go on the road, you only find the roads are jam-packed. You can't even find a space to work properly. Nowadays, the, in fact, the drivers drive on the footpath. They don't even leave that space for the person. That's, that's true. The footpaths are made for, you know, for people yeah. to walk on. But... You see, somewhere the cobblers are doing their work, somewhere something is going on, yes. So we don't have place People at all. I need to uh, drop my daughter yeah, pick, or pick my daughter from the tuitions, uh, from drawing class. I saw, I always see that there is no space to walk on the footpath only. Yeah, that's true, that's true. This is what is the real condition uh, in our country. But we have to think because we are no, all very greedy about everything. Uh, one house, if we have, we want to have second house. By the way, you manage to get second house, you will think of third house. So and all we, will think we have a, why shouldn't, I wish I could have a car. Then you fulfill one desire, then you, again, you will want to fulfill other desire. 
our desire yes. never ends ah uh, so we have endless endless needs actually and okay. that is the reason we are always busy finding out something or the other to fulfill our desire and busy making money busy making houses and greenery we don't Now think everyone is just ma'am running after money everyone wants money yes money is important we do we cannot deny that money is yeah. not required we cannot just simply uh, destroy nature uh, for the sake of making buildings or for the okay, sake of nobody nobody ready to ready to understand that that we should save nature in fact nowadays children should aware uh, neither children are aware in the school that we should save nature despite the fact that people don't and people don't understand and they are just cutting down the trees cutting down the trees to understand that one tree if we are cutting at least we need to plant one that is yeah. very important that is very important but the thing is if we will have land then only we can plant now there is the problem that we are not leaving land even all the forests we are cutting down to make huge factories and huge buildings and so those things have to be taken care of at least we love gardening too much too much i am passionate actually i have a great fascination towards gardening i have so many so many plants in my house in lucknow so i have told my maid to water them and to take care of them so that when i go i should not find one single plant died <laughs> that would be good ma'am yes ma i we should we should aware about the nature too ma'am that is that is very important we should take care of our nature and then probably so nature is going to we want to a good good air we want to breathe so we should take care of nature yes fresh air is important for everyone it's not only about us even for animals we are not yeah. doing for animals for plants for ourselves so we have to somewhere be very much aware of it yeah ma'am whenever i turn on the tv i always uh, come across that there is a great pollution in delhi no trees i always i always mm -hmm. come across this kind of news whenever yeah. i turn on the tv Yes. greenery is important for everyone isn't it yes ma'am so i am in my house otherwise sweden is so beautiful so beautiful that if you go out so you I'm will find the garden are you enjoying there i am enjoying a lot i am enjoying a lot first and foremost my daughter and my son in law they both are here so that is one reason to enjoy and secondly in india we have <laughs> hot summer and here it's quite comfortable neither it is too cold nor it is hot so it's moderate did you go over there shopping did you go any mall yes yes i went to <laughs> i went to <laughs> every day mall over there ma'am what kind of malls are there malls are more or less the same like us it's not okay. uh, much difference i didn't find yeah certain new brands are there which are not there in our countries otherwise the malls and everything is the same uh, but the discipline the pollution the population the behavior of the those things you can compare from our countries okay they is totally so, different that is totally different yeah if you will feel if you will find them like the way they behave the way they set their body language the way they talk yes they care about everything yes uh, so that that's the reason here nature is still good pure yeah ma'am yes ma'am it's it's good that you have you your daughter lives there so that you can go at any time ah uh, yeah 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 <laughs> yes but still i love my own country i i can just yeah. spend one month or two months in foreign countries but finally yeah. i feel like coming back to my own country Ah, ma'am. Yes. Ma yes, ma'am. Ma may please. I know, ma'am? Could you please give me your valuable feedback? Am I able to speak or not? Oh, you I are. Able, you are able to speak. You are able to speak. You are speaking well. You just have to practice as you are speaking. Just keep on doing that. And if you can record yourself, record. and then listen to your conversation once again as if i'm going to upload this video okay so you will see to it once again carefully 
minutely okay analyze yourself okay that way are you going wrong are you thinking to improve in certain areas maybe in terms of pronunciation in terms of speaking a little slow in terms of certain places tenses so those things you can just work upon that's it otherwise you are doing fantastic you are speaking well and it won't take much time for you to become a fluent fluent speaker thank you ma'am thank you thank you so much okay mamta it was a lovely lovely conversation and lovely connecting with you thank you so much same here i am very happy today <laughs> okay thank you so much i think you also must be having so much of work your daughter is there at home okay yeah ma'am she is standing behind me and she is listening to your conversation and later on she'll tell you that these many places you made mistake because today's kids you know they focus on each and every words pronunciation if you say my they will say no not my say my not i i <laughs> yeah <laughs> so they are very particular yes okay mamta i think we should wrap up the session now we can certainly catch up again in future okay yes sure we will catch up again okay bye bye